There's so many layers of how we show up. And at work, we may be on top of our game. And in our personal world, we may not be at all. Or vice versa. But there are areas of your life where you may need some understanding, healing. And I say this because when we are triggered, a younger, more wounded self starts to show up. And they don't know how to do that moment. And that is the perfect time, perfect moment to actually step into that uncomfortableness, feel into that fear, and flip the coin, change the story, change the outcome. I know that, that you do not want a younger, wounded version of yourself struggling in that moment. And I know that if I saw a little one struggling, that I would go and I would help them, assist them, protect them until they could get back in their game. And so that's what we're going to do when we get triggered is we're going to say, okay, little one, damaged one, worried, fear-based one that is showing up. I see you. I feel you. And I'm not going to let you be alone. So I'm going to remind myself to show up at my body's age, wisdom, intelligence. I'm going to upgrade my nervous system in that moment to my intelligence. And I'm going to win. That's why those moments show up. It's not here to again and again and again try to take you out of a good game. It's trying to up your game. So for instance, if you are out with friends and you tend to get a little too reserved, quiet, easily led by the crowd, it's a younger version that is showing up and, and you don't want that. You want to be your empowered self, to have a good time, to represent who you are in today's information. I get triggered a lot, of course. Those are beautiful moments for me to pay attention and correct my own behavior. Sometimes I'll nail it. Sometimes I may be a little slow in that moment. But then I'm going to become mindful and I'm going to correct my own automatics. At work, there's a lot of people that may be brilliant and then they get in front of a boss, a manager, and then they freeze. Do you see that that little one may not be able to handle authority, fear of losing? So from now on, you're going to say, watch me, little one. The one that has been struggling and I haven't shown up for, watch me. We're going to knock it out of the plate today. We're just going to show up, show up. And then once I do this one or two, possibly even three times, it becomes automatic. Do you see the wisdom, the growth, the insight of you being conscious, aware of how you are Showing up, it'll be more fun. It'll get you on a higher plane of energy. It will teach you so much about yourself. There's a lot of times because of my childhood, a nervous disorder since the age of three, fear-based energy, the whole nine yards. So I understand this at so many deep levels. But I also know that at my body's age, that I'm here to help, support, and correct my behavior so that when I get thrown back into the past, there is a adult person, adult man wanting authority that I just don't fall to the ground energetically and give in anymore. 
that at my age, I, I can correct their behavior. I can stand up for myself. It's not easy to live a life being led when a young one shows up. So get excited for some triggers. We can't stop them, but we can grow so that we can actually face the fear, the uncomfortableness of that moment and win. And won't that be exciting? And won't that be delicious? It's going to take a little bit of practice, but anything that is good, we need to upgrade ourselves to be that good. We're here to improve each and every day. And this in itself is going to be mind-blowing. And as far as what I do, I help you with these codes, these triggers. I get you to understand it and get you a good tight game and watch and help you practice. So it kind of becomes an automatic to stand up for yourself. Because I still get triggered at times, but not often. And now, when I do have these small triggers, please bet on me, because I'm winning. And I want you to win also. I want you to love yourself, support yourself. I want you to put yourself first. We have been taught to put others first. That's why we follow. If you're going to follow anybody, it's going to be following your higher self. That is success. I'm Diane at Healing Bodies, Healing Souls. Been doing this energy work, shifting, decoding, recoding, advancing energy for over 30 years. Good at what I do. And there's a moment where you're going to say, I'm tired of just being uncomfortable. I'm not going to hide anymore. And I'm going to reach out to Diane. And I know it will be uncomfortable. But I know that that's where my rewards are. And I know now I deserve them. Deep bow and thank you.